these clouds are all simulated with these black lines. That's true. What I learned. What are they hiding, right? So that's another show called Declouding. I might take it on one day. I usually lose people when I go too too crazy, you know? But this little tool's fun to check out stuff. Let me go to the next one. Oh yeah, here we go. Back to the room. This is some of Phil's pictures. And this this is the newest shot. And I want to show you something. You guys have seen this rim before. And this is an artificial light in the middle here. We've discovered all that with Phil. Behind here, this is what I believe it's hiding behind this, this rim. And if you go look through my playlist, one that's called Sky Machines, it'll show you a whole lot more than this. And here's the rim. It's pretty detailed, pretty clear. Now if I go down here to sweep, okay, now watch this. You want to look how it doubled up. Let me show you what it's doing. Kind of threw me off for a second. But basically, <laughs> you just have to look at it. There's multiple rims. Some are turned on, some are not. Some are reflected by the one that is turned on. So now you're seeing the other rim behind it. You see the rim up here? And it's like a mirror effect of another rim with another blue planet or this white planet. So are they hiding? Is that two planets or is that two rim? That light's turned off. Now watch, it just gets better. <laughs> it gets better. Now the Illuminous Grantis tool shows me that there's one object. That's it. There, it can't, it's this thing like pulls it, whatever the object is, that's it. There's no two objects. So it's an illusion that it makes. Ain't that a trip? It's just an illusion that it's making. Okay, we go back up here to level sweep. Now what we're seeing, you ever see those double planets trip out on you? You're going, what's going on? There's two planets. What's well, doing this? It's making an illusion. It's getting us all jacked up that we think we're seeing three planets. We're only seeing this object, you know, doing its thing. But I studied this for a second and said this is just reflecting off itself and bringing an illusion that there's multiple planets or multiple objects. Let's go to auto contrast by color. This is up and close right here, guys. Now, could this be another lens like this one that's lit? Could this other one be a lens? And there be another one, you know, a ways off? I don't know. See how this thing is picking up objects in the background? They're not even in the front ground. Oh, see that? Look at all this stuff going on. It's all part of the illusion. Look at this, guys. See, it's showing me the objects way out here. See, so that... I think there's multiple of them. And I think... <clears throat> I just busted them on it because I think there's five, six, seven of them out there in one spot. Okay, we go back to the magnifier. Let's go back to the Luminous Granis. And this tool basically shows you what's really there. Everything else is an illusion. There's just one object there. See, and the intensity just brings it up because this whole thing, like, the center thing, see how it has a ridge? It's a light. You see the thing behind it? It's a circle, like a flat circle. And I see how they, this one has, this, this rim has texture. This light is like a bulb. The thing behind it, you know, you can't see it really good with the magnifier, but see the difference? Um, That's, that's just that sunshade. This is the object right there. That's what that's the picture that, that Phil caught right there. Because he uses all these special high dollar filters to get through all that 
distraction like on the other picture we looked at from uh, from uh, Phil or from Johnson it gets weird right so one more let me call it quits okay this one right here is definitely this is where I kept insisting is other lenses now watch this we're right in the sweep Okay, you see those objects up there? Now watch how this thing has got multiple objects. And they're all the reflections are bouncing off each other. They turn one on, turn one off. You ever see it flicker? Maybe these things just get, they have to have multiple of them. Now let's go down to the Luminous Grantus and see what's real. How many there are there actually there? One. So how are they doing the smoke and mirrors? I don't know. See down here, you see these are just like sitting there waiting. I don't think they're planets either, guys. It's a mind, it's a mind melt here. They're doing a mind melt on us. Got us thinking all, they'll use this thing for the moon and everything. Uh, no lie. We've been fooled. Turn the intensity up. See, there's, a, there's an object there, just like on the other one is the blue planet blue object, a gray object, the best one right there too. See they're just like this object. These are one farther back, one closer up, you know, back and forth. Let's go to our level sweep. You can get a lot of different, you can see a lot of what's going on. See that one up there. That red one up there. It's a mind game guys, so be careful. What you think you're seeing is an illusion by lights. It's a light illusion. You know, uh, it says that the enemy will come as an angel of light. See, this is all lights. See how they... Now, reality is, and I don't understand it totally, if we use this object right here, this is what's real. See, if this was the sun, let's just assume that was the sun, why would it be flat when it would be, you know, you would pick up the texture of the sun? You see an object there and you see an object here. You see the rim right here. Just totally gives it away. Okay, so it's just this little mind game. Just so you guys know, I want you to, be a, I want you to know the truth. That will make you free. God bless.